Hi, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can send files, large files, through emails to your friend because you can't just send it normally as you send your messages or the way you send all your PDF to your friends. Now, you need to first upload it to Google Drive. You can notice this. I don't just try putting it right here to my email and it's telling me this. Now, the large file must be shared with google with google drive so you can't just send it like that you need to upload it to google drive then a link will be sent along with the email then your friend can now download it from there so what we're going to do is we're now going to go ahead and pick the two videos i want to send drag it into my email then click ok right there then right now it's been uploaded to google drive so the two videos been uploaded okay i have an arrow so if you see this arrow just go ahead and connect to the internet this means there's no internet connection and it's not being uploaded so go ahead connect to the internet okay so once you are done i'm just going to drag it back again i'm gonna drag the videos back because i was not connected that's a very funny thing trying to send email without connecting to the internet okay so this is it right here so it's uploading this might take some time it's pretty a bit slow and it sort of depends on the speed of your internet so you have to wait for it to upload before you can now send it now take note of this there are many ways you can send large files to your friends or to your family but if you want to do it by email one of the another alternative way you can do it is by uploading the files to google drive already instead of going to your email then start uploading it to google drive from there you can just go to google drive and upload it once you're done uploading it you get a link from there then put it into your email, then send it. Then they can now click on it, then download it. That's another way they can do it. And I will be showing you how you can do it in another video. So right here, you can now see the files I have, have been uploaded. And you can go ahead and type in a subject. You no, know, just normal email. As you're sending a normal email, email to your friends, just type in the subject after that. You can come down type in a topic or something a message along if you want to so you can now come down and click on send after you click on send the videos will be sent to your friends all they need to do then is to click on it and download it also make sure the settings that you use now google drive has settings that um my hinder them from downloading or from be able to see the content in the files so i'm going to be showing you how you can do that and the settings that you should use depending on what the person you're sending the video to what is going to do with it is do you want him to be able to just comment not able to make any change you want him to be able to make changes to it you you also need to signify that so just ask yourself what do you what is it going to do with the video depending on what the person is going to do with the video that's what you're going to use for the settings now let me show you what i'm talking about click right here once you click right here we have this option up here so we have three options one is share with people the second one is allow anyone with the link to access and the last one is don't give access so the first one says share with people i mean i can only share the content with people who i have typed in their email account you can see this email right here then the second one is allow anyone with the link so anyone with the link can access it then the last one is don't give access 
um, which maybe we want to make it private and we don't want anybody to even take a look at the content. But as long as you're saying sharing, um, you want these people to view the content, the best ones to go with is allow anyone with the link to access. If the content is something you want to share with anybody, with with a group of people or anyone, but if it's with a specific person, you could go with the first one, share with people, and you the email of the person is right here. So which means you must already type the email of the group of people you are sending it to in the email slot in the beginning. So that's it guys. So next thing we're going to do is just click on send. After clicking on send, the email will be sent and our, our receiver can now go through it. That's it. Thanks for watching this video.